One of the things I've realized is that it's important to release all the toxicity from our lives. So I've created the following list of things to let go of. Mean people and backstabbers. Thank you very much for your douching abilities that has taught me the value of detachment. Thank you. Processed foods. So long, high fructose corn syrup, hydrogenated soybean oil, natural and artificial flavorings, and the rest of you. You know who you are. You know. Exenoestrogens. Despite sounding like a superhero, you are an evil force that I have no room for in my life. So in this week's video, I'm going to be giving you the lowdown on xenoestrogens, what it is, and how to ditch it from your world. So for those of you who don't know what xenoestrogens are, these are foreign substances that mimic estrogens in our body that disrupt our hormones. They're found in everything from plastics to toothpaste to food sprayed with pesticides and even our makeup. particularly detrimental to our uterus, our breasts, our immune and neurological symptoms, and growth development. Yep, I'm talking about everything from young girls getting their periods early, women getting ovarian cysts, and men getting, well, man boobs. <laughs> So instead of trying to get you to change your entire world overnight and overwhelm you, I thought I'd provide you with some small but huge changes that you can make to your hormonal world. Xenoestrogens are lipophilic. In other words, that means that they love fat. So don't store your food in these plastic containers and most certainly don't microwave in them. Instead, put them into glass containers. And today, I'm going to be giving you a recipe in a mason jar that you could take to work that you are going to love. I mean, have I ever let you down so far? <laughs> You're going to need some diced tomatoes, cooked chicken, some goat cheese, an avocado, romaine lettuce, and even some sautéed cauliflower. Now I know some of you might not be a fan of the white broccoli. <laughs> I do believe that the politically correct term is cruciferous vegetable of unpigmented color. <laughs> Hormone balancing salad. Super simple. Now on to the salad dressing. Your skin absorbs anything that you put on your face, and makeup is no exception. So you want to be especially careful with parabens. You certainly don't have to change all your makeup overnight. You can begin, believe it or not, as using your food as makeup. I, in fact, use cacao powder as my bronzer. In the meantime, small steps can make way for huge changes, and I'm going to be speaking more about hormonal balance in my upcoming webinar about PCOS and ovarian cysts that you're not going to want to miss. In the meantime, enjoy! Oh shit. I thought I'd give you some small but huge changes. Five second rule. 